Hi, this is Lloyd Allen at FixingMarriages.com. Today I'd like in this video presentation to talk about understanding women. Heal your marriage by understanding your wife. A lot of men are confused. They are at a loss for words. They are overwhelmed with the fact that they cannot understand their wife. Now, I want to say this a few things today. Number one, I want to say this, that if you do not understand a woman, your hope of living a happily ever after life with her will only be a dream. You cannot successfully live with a woman. In other words, you cannot have a successful relationship with a woman except you understand women. The Bible is true. It's interesting that the Bible has a lot to say about the woman's duty to a man. The Bible says, for example, wife, reverence your husband, honor him, respect him. In another section, the Bible says, submit to him. But it's interesting to know that when God is speaking to the man, you know what he says? He says to the man, understand a woman. 1 Peter 3 and verse 7, the Bible says, Husband, dwell with them according to knowledge, giving honor unto the wife as unto the weaker vessel, etc. Another rendering of the Bible says, dwell with her in an understanding way. You must understand a woman if you are to have a happy life with her. I had a counseling session some time ago. I asked the husband, how is it? How has it been since we last met? How has it, how has it been since the last session? And that's the, my usual way of commencing a session. I say, how has it been since we last met? The man said, it's fine. I'm good. Everything is good. I don't have a problem. I asked the lady the same question, how has it been since we last met? She says, I'm upset, I'm sad, we don't have good communication, I feel like I just cannot get through to him. You see, a man can settle for a marriage that is a business of sort. He has his needs met, his basic needs met, he's okay. Basic needs, he's okay. So a man can settle for a marriage that is maybe not so deep in terms of intimacy and and communication of feelings but not a woman and because of this a lot of men are bewildered confused perplexed they cannot get through to their wife they cannot get through to her and she remains unhappy discontented miserable unsatisfied, dissatisfied for hours and days and sometimes even weeks. But I want to share with you men, if you never get to really understand that woman, you could live with her for the next 15, 20 years and you are never happy with her. 
And so my question to you men, do you really want to live happily with that woman? Well, if you do, there are a few things about a woman that you must understand. A few things. Number one, you must understand this, that a surface, superficial relationship will drive a man's wife wild with frustration. If, if, if the relationship is not deep and abiding, if she's not enjoying intimacy at the deepest levels, she will always be unhappy as long as you live with her. Remember that. And so, let me just share with you quickly how different a woman is than a man in many cases and how, how she's deeply emotional. And a man must understand the emotional engine that drives a woman. And if you men don't understand that, Forget it. Your hope of living a happy life with her is only a dream. Okay? So this import so this video presentation should be important for every man. For example, let's talk about for example her sexual nature. If a man has a woman, if a man has a quarrel with his wife at 9 a.m. at 9:15 AM, he's okay. <laughs> Talking about human sexuality. He's okay. Some may even say at 9 10, he's okay. But on the other hand, if a woman has a quarrel with her husband at 9 AM, If her feelings have been that have been wounded are not massaged and healed, she has a quarrel at 9 a.m. at 10 o'clock p.m. the next day, and she's still not ready. Is that true? Yes, it is. And so, the man might be wondering, oh, 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 I don't understand. We had a quarrel yesterday. We had a talk yesterday at 9 o'clock in the morning. And you still haven't got over it? He's bewildered. But that's a woman. She's deeply emotional. And so, a woman's sexual nature... And her psychological nature are closely intertwined. They are linked. And until her, her, her wounded feelings are healed, she'll never be able to respond sexually. And so it is imperative that a man understands his wife. Else he might be living with her in misery for many years and is confused that he is incapable, he feels incapable of helping the marriage. And so, men, I want to share with you about three things that you must do in a relationship. If you are to improve that marriage as you live with your wife, understand her. The first thing is this. When you enter marriage, and this of course goes for those who are not yet married, if you are not prepared to be 100% committed to the marriage, do not marry. For I want to share with you this. A woman cannot deal with a 
surface superficial relationship she's either she she must either have you 100% or not at all okay if it's a surface relationship or you are always eyeing or gazing at another person then she's shortchanged you will have a miserable woman by your side as long as you live if you do not reform and give her 100% of your attention so that's the first thing to men who are not yet married and take this seriously if you are not prepared to be 100% committed to that woman in a marital relationship do not marry her number one Number two, when you enter marriage, you must enter marriage with this concept. Girl, I just want to be your student. Please teach me. In other words, you must enter marriage with a teachable spirit. For there's a lot that you will need to learn about that woman. And much of what you will learn, let me put it another way, the best lessons that you can learn about her is what she tells you about herself. So when she's ready to talk, you be ready to listen and learn. So you must enter marriage with a teachable spirit and say, I want you to be my teacher. I want to make you happy. Please tell me what your needs are so I can meet your needs. For if I don't know what your needs are, I might be doing a lot of things, but you're going to still be unhappy. For if I don't know what your needs are, I can't meet those needs. So please, darling, teach me. I'm ready to listen. That must be your posture your modus operandi, your attitude, your approach when you marry that woman. Allow her to be your teacher. So you must possess a teachable spirit. Number three. I told you three things, but it may be a little more than that. Number three. Listen to her. You must be a great listener. Remember this. If you are to have a great marriage, you must be a great listener. And if you come if you interview those men who have been married for 50, 60 years, one of the things they will most likely share with you as a secret to their marriage is that he has learned to be a good listener. Whenever your wife is upset and she's ready to talk, you be ready to listen. And if you should interrupt her, it must be with the words, tell me more. Okay, so whenever she's ready to talk, put aside everything else and listen. And when you listen, don't listen passively with the remote in your hand or the newspaper or the telephone as though you're just waiting for her to be through so you can continue the conversation on the other line. Not at all. Don't just listen passively. You must listen actively. And say, okay, I understand. Do I hear you saying so and so? Ah, oh, okay, so help me understand. Um, did you say so and so? In other words, talk back to her. Clarify as you go along to make sure you understand her. 
Number three. Number four. As you listen to her, remember this. It is not so much advice that she wants. She just wants a sounding board. A woman listens for many reasons. A woman sometimes listens to feel close to you. She listens to so she can sort her thinking out. She listens for different reasons. And so don't be too quick to always give advice. That's not what she needs. <laughs> okay? She needs a sounding board. She needs you to listen. And when you listen, you are really conversely giving her therapy. For you give her an opportunity to vent, to express herself. Okay? There's a lot more I could say, but I have written a book, Understanding Women. Understand your wife and heal your marriage. This is a book that every man should possess. And it's more like a course because I really planned it to be an ebook, but it's like a course because I have video presentation as well there. And it's very, very cheap, okay? Less than Forty dollars. Okay, so it's not like a it's not like a counseling assignment where you pay two hundred or one hundred and fifty dollars. It's a mini course, but it's a course that can save your marriage. Okay, man. So remember, pick up this course and ladies, get this e course, this mini course for your husband. Very, um, very cheap, but. It can make the difference between success and failure in your marriage. I love you all very much. And you can, if you'd like to follow my video presentations, you can subscribe at lloydallen.org or fixingmarriages.com. All right? God bless you. Hope to see you soon and have a good day. And remember this, men, understand your wife. And a happy wife. The saying is still true. Happy wife. Happy life. Have a good day. Until we meet again. And remember, pick up your copy of your book today. Understanding women. Understand your wife and heal your marriage. Love you. God bless. Bye.